Hey, hey, my crafty friends. We are using an Easter print from Digital Deco Designs. So I used this board, just three scrap pieces with some popsicle sticks glued together to use it as a backdrop. This is a leftover canvas frame that I am using. I used the canvas for something else. So we're gonna decoupage this rice paper onto the scrap wood. Make sure and line it up right. And then go back over the front just to give it some good protection and adhesion. Let it dry. So I'm gonna glaze over this frame. It is already painted in peacock feather. Oh, actually, that's a top coat. I'm putting that on. Whitewash. It's a whitewash. So we're going to tone down that peacock feather just a little bit. Let that dry. I've got this little board. I was trying to figure out where I'm going to put that on the side. I want to paint this in flamingo, which is such a pretty pink when you Put it next to that peacock feather that screams springtime. So we got that all painted. We're adding some diamond dust. <clears throat> diamond dust makes everything better. So I'm using part of this stencil. And I've got something different we're going to use as the O. That's actually a little charm I got from Walmart in their sewing notions. So we're going to use some cotton. I'm using, of course, all rethunk junk. Cotton is the whitest white on that pink. It just makes it pop. That charm had a little hook at the top. I wanted that off, so we just hot glued that on with our Sherbonder glue off the diamond dust. Now we're going to cut our paper to fit our board. Actually just use an X-Acto knife. Now I'm using some distressing inks just all over the paper, just to give it more of an antique look. And the board. We'll hot glue the back of the canvas frame, center that, put it in place. Figure out our placement, then we'll hot glue that down. Now we're going to dress up the frame. I've got some little silk rose, pink silk roses and some ribbon. And we're going to make that little bunny three-dimensional. Now we're going to use some solo wood flowers. I have just become an affiliate for them and I love those flowers. So we hot glued that into place. Now we're putting our pink roses all over the place on his little neck next to the ribbon and then all around the frame. So this is such a pretty color, bright spring little sign. I will put the links in the description where you can get your flowers and your digital deco arts. Happy crafting.